yes ma'am yes ma'am yes ma'am okay so uh, these are just the instructions that are given which i have gone through and i am sure you must have uh, taken out some other subject test so you must have gone through these instructions okay so i'll just start or proceed with the test we have one hour for 25 question that constitutes around 1 minute uh, approximately 1 minute 20 seconds per question okay <clears throat> okay so the first question here is uh, i want you all to answer keep your mics on okay if if not able to then i will go ahead okay antiviral action of neem is due to azadi retin nimbin camphorol or melanin लाख पुड़े सरा अबे आप पे है ना माइक कीप योर माइक ऑफ सम पार्टिसिपेंट इज ऑन द माइक ओके एनीवन हैज द आंसर निम्बिन निम्बिन ओके ओके सो आंसर टू दिस इज निम्बिन द व्हाई निम्बिन बिकॉज़ इफ यू सी अजाडी रेटिन कैम्फेरो अजाडी रेटिन इज अगेन वन ऑफ द इंपोर्टेंट कंस्टिट्यूएंट वी से नेम नेम हैज अजाडी रेटा इंडिका ओके सो अगेन अजाडी रेटिन इज वन बट हाउ यू थिंक ऑफ निम्बिन बिकॉज़ निम्बिन निम्बिडीन एंड निम्बिन इन आर द अल्कलॉइड्स दैट आर रिस्पांसिबल फॉर द एंटीवायरल एक्शन सिमिलरली देयर आर टू अदर मोर अल्कलॉइड्स दैट आर रिस्पांसिबल फॉर सम डिफरेंट एक्शन ओके so in this type of question this is a memory kind of a question you don't need to apply much of logic here okay and uh, this is a pretty simple question okay next question the glycoside silarisoid in red squill acts as what ma'am rodenticide rodenticide option d yeah. okay option d rodenticide very correct now in this type of question uh, first of all when you think of red squill you come to normal white squill okay orginia maritima correct so that squill bulbs you have in mind and that will click about cardiotonic action okay so then how will you learn this now uh, for red squill there is a separate chapter of natural pesticides okay and in that you study red squill it is not when you study the norial a normal squill in cardioactive glycosides okay so rodenticide is the answer for this okay now given below are two statements one is labeled as assertion and the other is labeled as reason so now for these type of questions i would request you all that don't uh, first of all think on assertion and reason okay first have the logic about just there are two statements okay just there are two statements that are present and i have to read out both the statements and i have to understand okay and see whether the statements are correct or not okay have that logic now the first statement here is ayurvedic drug asava contains self generated alcohol okay so uh, asava if you know asava and arishtas <coughs> they are prepared by this method and there are self generation a self generation of alcohol is prepared okay that uh, using the decoction method okay that is how asava is prepared okay and second is for the preparation of asava the extract of drug is subjected to a person of calcination okay so now i am assuming you don't know what is asava okay we don't know what is asava so in that type of uh, scenario uh, also the reason r is incorrect okay because there is no drug that can be prepared by subject to a person of calcination okay there are uh, bhasmas that are produced but that is that undergoes process of plant calcination uh, metal calcination okay now this is person of calcination so from here r is incorrect that you will come to know so r is not correct is we know and that is only the one option okay now another is both a and r are okay both now there is only one option in this case, case where r is not correct so then directly in this case this is your answer you don't need to look after the other options okay
नेक्स्ट द रिंग प्रेजेंट इन स्ट्रिचनिंग इज ओके स्ट्रिचरीन अगर याद नहीं आ रहा है तो स्टिकनस नक्सवामी का ऐसा याद आएगा तो नक्सवामी का वॉज देर इन वॉट टाइप ऑफ एल्कोलॉज सो लाइक दैट यू कैन इंडोल 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 सो आंसर इज इंडोल एल्कोलॉइड नेक्स्ट सेलिसीन ऑन हाइड्रोलिस इल्स वॉट ओके now to attempt this type of question if you know then only you attempt otherwise let go i would say okay these type of questions because uh, see if you don't have in memory what is salicine itself then you will not be able to attempt this question so i would uh, suggest that if you don't have in memory then please let go don't take negative marking unnecessarily for these type of questions okay now for your anyone knows the answer okay i would C. say sorry b option yeah option b so that is very correct now salicine it undergoes uh, hydrolysis to salicinin and glucose and salicinin here is salicinin here is nothing but salicyl alcohol so option b is the correct answer so this is a glycoside okay shikmic acid passed by corismic mutase converts corismic acid to what now this is a very easy question again shikmic acid passed by everyone remembers okay and this is very easy question okay anyone with the answer maine padha hai shikmic acid corismic acid is converted to prefinic acid or prefinic okay so answer correct option here is a so this is a memory type of a question okay in lo the mucilage containing parenchymatous cells are present in what okay now in this you have to apply little bit of logic okay agar tumko ye pata nahi hai answer to just apply logic now what are the option pericycl uh, pericyclic cells epidermis central parenchymatous region and vascular bundles now remember vascular bundles will be xylem and phloem and generally they are not the one which will have the stored uh, content okay like latex volatile oil or any other stored content mucilage oil so that is not present in vascular bundles even epidermis will not contain that so these two options are eliminated now you have two other options pericyclic cells and central parenchymatous region now when we talk about mucilage there are two parts one is latex and one is mucilage generally what is seen is latex is present in the outer part and mucilage is present in the inner part okay that is the logic you can apply while answering so this simple answer for this goes to as central parenchymatous region okay pericyclic cells has presence of latex if you don't know make this, uh, make a note of this pericyclic cells has present of presence of latex <clears throat> next question is this is a very again easy question drag and drop reagent is what potassium bismuth powder okay yes so okay one second ha huh. oh i won't be able to uh, see your chat so i try to on the chat and there is a warning coming so i won't be able to see chat so you on your mic only hmm so potassium bismuth iodide abhi ye yaad nahi aa raha hai to maine iska mnemonics bola tha ek agar kisi ko yaad nahi hai to ye yaad kar sakte ho abhi ke liye that you can remember this as mm mercuric iodide mayors reagent aisa bola tha maine yaad aa raha hai mercuric iodide mayors reagent then a uh, potassium iodide ke liye uh, and sorry bismuth iodide drag and drop bd aisa yaad rakhne bola tha mm bd theek hai fir ye hagers to alag hi tha picrolonic acid tha picric acid tha that is potassium picrate and iodine potassium iodate that is nothing but your wagner's reagent theek hai to ye do agar yaad reh rahe picric acid yaad rehne wala hai to wagner's ekdam easy ho jata hai yaad rakhna jo remaining hai wo wagner's hai. ठीक है, ओके रोजेट्स ऑफ कैल्शियम ऑक्सिलेट क्रिस्टल्स आर फाउंडेड यस ट्रूबाब 
ओके रूबा तो दिस इज अगेन अ मेमोरी क्वेश्चन ठीक है सबसे पहले प्रैक्टिकल में वी सी दिस ओनली रोजेट्स ऑफ रूबाब रूबाब शो वेरी नाइस फ्लावर शेप्ड रोजेट्स फॉर दिस ऑल्सो आई हैड आस्ट यू ऑल टू मेक चार्ट ओके एसिक्यूलर किस में दिखता है सम ड्रग्स दैट यू कैन रिकलेक्ट इंपॉर्टेंट ड्रग्स Now, shellac is a resinous substance prepared from secretion that encrusts the bodies of a scale insect. Which is the scale insect? D option. Option D. Option D. Caria laca. Okay. Abhi now, if you don't know, uh, think you don't know this answer. So shellac is nothing but lac. Okay. And lac say you can remember caria laca. That is how you can relate. try to relate options with the question where you don't know the answer okay and that will help you okay which one of the following is unorganized drug this is again a very easy question acacia gum 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 okay so yahan pe uh, see this is easy because you are been given what type which part of the plant okay supposedly if you know if you are not being given which part of the plant then in that case you have to think say say agar yahan se main baak, baaki ka ye cheeze hata deti hu raulfia acacia sena cinchona itna hi rehne deti hu then in that case you need to think but this was very easy because organized are something that will have all the parts of the plant so the acacia is the direct answer <clears throat> Which one of the following alkaloid contain isoquinoline nucleus? Anyone? Papaverin. Papaverin. Okay. Okay. Papaverin. Okay. Then in that case, I would ask you all what which uh, quinine contains what type of nucleus? Quinoline. Correct. Uh, hyoscyamine. मेमोरी टाइप ऑफ अ क्वेश्चन Jinko is not useful in what of this which of this condition <clears throat> Jinko here means jinko biloba okay so which of these conditions it is not used now again in this okay anyone knows the answer i will wait for 10 seconds and then i will explain you how you can solve this okay so uh, assuming you will not uh, you are not able to because generally while lectures i have told that useful use kind of questions are rarely seen in gpat okay but if you get such a question what will you do try to relate the options first okay uske pehle wo drug ke bare mein kuch ek characteristic point yaad aata hai to wo yaad karo okay now jinko was generally used is generally used in case of alzheimer patients ओके अल्जाइमर और डिमेंशिया पेशेंट्स ओके सो वेन आई से अल्जाइमर या डिमेंशिया इट वॉज अ वेरी यू कैन से मार्कर ड्रग विच वॉज यूज इन द ट्रीटमेंट ओके तो ये मैंने बताया था ड्यूरिंग माई लेक्चर तो इतना याद आ रहा है बाकी कुछ याद नहीं आ रहा है तो इन दैट केस वॉट यू कैन डू थोड़ा सा हम टेन परसेंट गैस वर्क भी करेंगे इसमें सो डिमेंशिया तो यू नो ठीक है डिमेंशिया नाउ एंड अस्थमा ओके सो अस्थमा के लिए भी यूज होता है ये भी हमने मैंने लिखवाया था तुम लोग को तो डिमेंशिया और अस्थमा विल यू हैव टू ऑप्शन विच आर कन्फर्म नाउ यू आर कन्फ्यूज इन अदर टू ऑप्शन हिपेटाइटिस एंड इन्फ्लेमेशन सो इन दैट वॉट यू कैन डू नाउ डिमेंशिया अस्थमा अस्थमा इज अ क्रॉनिक कंडीशन वेर देर इज इन्फ्लेमेशन जनरली सो जिंको इफ इट विल नॉट क्योर इन्फ्लेमेशन इट वोट बी एबल टू क्योर द रेस्ट टू थिंग्स okay so inflammation will be there so ideally what can be the if you correlate the options you can say hepatitis it will not be useful okay so i uh, click here uh, check here as hepatitis size of lycopodium spore is 
25 correct so this is i will not explain because this is just a memory question again okay in gambier fluorescent test the petroleum spirit layer shows a strong what fluorescence ग्रीन फ्लोरोसेंस ओके सो अगर ये भी याद नहीं आ रहा है तो गैम्बीर फ्लोरिसन याद करो गैम्बीर फ्लोरिसन से यू विल बी एबल टू रिमेम्बर ओनली वन थिंग दैट इज टैन इन टैन इन से अगर थोड़ा और को रिलेट करेंगे तो हमें पेल कटैच यू याद आता है विच गिव दिस टेस्ट ओके सो नाउ जनरली फ्लोरोसेंस इज वॉट इज सीन इन दिस केस इज आइदर ग्रीन और ब्लू ओके मोर एक्यूरेट विच इज बीन प्रिंटेड इज ए ग्रीन इन बुक्स ठीक है सो यू माइट गेट कंफ्यूज बिटवीन ग्रीन एंड ब्लू अगर मेमोरी में याद नहीं है तो तो अगर इसको याद रखना है तो जी फॉर गैम्बीर जी फॉर ग्रीन ऐसा याद रख सकते हो ओके अ फिक्स ऑयल व्हेन एडेड टू एन इक्वल वॉल्यूम्स ऑफ इथेनॉल क्लियर लिक्विड इज ऑप्टेड ऑन कूलिंग एट जीरो डिग्री एंड ऑन स्टोरेज फॉर थ्री आवर्स द लिक्विड रिमेन्स क्लियर सच फिक्स ऑयल इज आइडेंटिफाइड एज वॉट मेमोरी If at all, if at all, you don't recollect this, okay? So यहाँ पे क्या और एक तुम चीज कर सकते हो Fixed oil लिखा है मतलब मैं अगर होती और मेरे को याद ही नहीं है तो so what would I have done? ठीक है तो fixed oil अगर लिखा है तो evening primer rose oil is not a fixed oil but a volatile oil. ये मैंने पढ़ा है ठीक है okay. Next. neem oil is nothing neem oil is again uh, a oil which has more of volatile constituents okay so now two option bachte hai soya bean or castor okay to abhi at least two option mere eliminate ho gaye aur fir main thoda sa aur deep mein sochungi to you will be able to recollect castor oil theek hai so that is again another way which i am telling you of course if you have in memory go through directly with castor oil the major pra property of ayurvedic herb rasa indicates anyone okay this topic i haven't uh, taken in your regular classes but how will you solve this okay so in this type of question uh, see ba basic eight different formulations of i uh, eight different ayurvedic formulations you should know like asava arista uh, uh, bhasmas uh, how they are prepared generally that that much you should know rasas okay so now rasa is something ras bolte hai na hum log to ek aisa bhi tum correlate kar sakte ho ras is nothing but taste okay so major property for this rasa is taste okay there are six different uh, types of taste like bitter sour salty okay and that salt um, that taste will generate the subsequent therapeutic property like bitter will give you a stomachic property okay so that is uh, taste is the answer for this question i want you all to know the basic two do ya teen line har ek ayurvedic formulation ke bare mein likh ke le lo aaj in color test for alkaloids colchicin with mineral acid gives what color this is a direct question if you know attempt it anyone uh, recollects yellow color yes okay. correct correct answer is yellow color okay so this is again direct question you have if you know if you have it in memory see one question you will get like this ki tumko memory mein hai then only you will be able to answer that okay following classification of herbal drug give better understanding of biosynthetic pathway in the drug chemotaxonomic chemotaxonomic yes. this i have taken i think in last of one of the last lectures only okay chemotaxonomic where there is a 
clear cut uh, correlation between chemical and taxonomy that is biosynthetic pathway the fundamental principle law of similia falls under which therapy anyone homeopathy homeopathy okay okay so for this again four systems general uh, thing about the four systems you should know okay like if i have to say about homeopathy is of course the correct answer if i have to say about siddha ye main thoda sa bata de rahi hu if you want you can note it down okay siddha is constituting of five basic elements which is known as panchabhutam then it has three humors which is known as mukatram 96 tatvas which are the factors and six taste which is known as arusuvai okay that is how that is the principle of, uh, of what uh, siddha is based upon okay ayurveda is based upon to treat the illness rather than to treat the symptoms like allopathy right now uh, we see that there is treatment of symptoms rather than the treatment of the illness okay homeopathy is based upon law of similia like like cures like okay and uh, another uh, what law is based up, uh, on what law homeopathy is based upon is law of infinite symbols which means more dilute the substance more potent it is okay so that is homeopathy and aromatherapy everyone is uh, everyone must be aware well aware it is based upon the volatile oils okay regol regolaramines a to f have been isolated from kurchi kurchi okay ye yaad tha ya aur koi logic lag raha hai ma'am uska biological source hola hai na antidepressant yes 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 that logic only i want you all to apply biological source okay agar hum dekhte hain to uh, veratrum ka chalo alag lag raha hai naam yaad nahi hai chhod do कुर्ची का होलेराना एंटीडिसेंट्री का एकोनाइट का अकोनेटिकम कुछ है एंड अरिका इज अरिका जनरली एज अरिकोल ही ओके सो इफ यू रिकलेक्ट दैट मच ऑल्सो नो यू विल बी एबल टू अंडरस्टैंड दैट रेग होलेरा माइंस इज ऑफ कुर्ची ओके दैट इज लॉजिक यू कैन अप्लाय ओके पंजेंसी ऑफ जिंजिबर ऑफिसनाले राइजो इज ड्यू टू प्रेजेंस ऑफ वॉट जिंजर ऑल सो इन दिस जिंजर ऑल इज द आंसर इन केशिया अंगस्टिफोलिया शॉर्ट टर्म ड्रॉट कॉजेज लॉस ऑफ लीफ बायोमास इंक्रीज द कॉन्सेंट्रेशन ऑफ सेनोसाइट कॉजेज द डेथ ऑफ द प्लांट और डिक्रीज द कॉन्सेंट्रेशन ऑफ सेनोसाइट डिक्रीज द कॉन्सेंट्रेशन इंक्रीज डिक्रीज कौन बोल रहा है और क्यों बोल रहा है अया वाई यू सेट डिक्रीज किसी ने डिक्रीज बोला ना ठीक है ओके सो आंसर करेक्ट आंसर यर इज इंक्रीज द कॉन्सेंट्रेशन ऑफ सेनोसाइट ए एंड बी नाउ दिस इज पर्टिक्युलर लॉजिक इज बेस्ड अपॉन योर मेमोरी अगेन and this has been proven in papers okay there are many biological papers that have proved that short term drought causes the increase of concentration of xenocytes these were there in our preparation slides as well okay which uh, plants which are not differentiated into roots stem le and leaves are what Talophytes. Talophytes. Okay. So again, this is a memory type of a question. Okay. Yeah. In fact, हमने twelfth में ही पढ़ा है. ऐसा नहीं है कि अभी पढ़ रहे. Okay. Talophyta, Bryophyta, Teredophyta ये सब पढ़ा है twelfth के time पे भी. Or if you want, you can once more clear up your basics. Okay. Okay. Last question. All the members of this order are trees or shrubs. mostly evergreen like 
with needles like leaves uh, monoecious or dioecious sporophylls usually in cones resin ducts occur in all parts anyone would like to guess धीरे धीरे सोचते है ओके ठीक है नाउ ऑल इफ दिस मेंबर्स आर ट्रीज और शव मोस्टली एवरग्रीन लाइक नीडल्स ओके विद नीडल्स सो दे हैव समथिंग दैट इज कॉल्ड एस नीडल्स नाउ जिंका जिंका गोल्स जिंका ओल्स डू नॉट हैव नीडल लाइक स्ट्रक्चर ओके ठीक है देन दे हैव लीव्स मोनोएशियस और डाइशियस ना मोनोएशियस डाइशियस क्या है ये पहले पता होना चाहिए क्या होता है मोनोएशियस डाइशियस प्लांट्स विच हैव बोथ फीमेल एंड मेल मोनोएशियस इज समथिंग दैट विल हैव वेयर सेम प्लांट विल हैव बोथ मेल एंड फीमेल रिप्रोडक्टिव ऑर्गेट्स ओके डाय मतलब इन द सेम प्लांट ओके सेम आई वुड से सेम वन प्लांट नाउ व्हेन डाइशियस इज समथिंग दैट देयर विल बी टू प्लांट्स वन विल बी हैविंग वन विल बी बेयरिंग फीमेल रिप्रोडक्टिव ऑर्गन्स एंड द अदर विल बी बेयरिंग मेल रिप्रोडक्टिव ऑर्गन्स सो दैट इज डाइशियस दिस इज इन डिफरेंट पार्ट्स ऑफ द प्लांट से फॉर एग्जाम्पल मेल पार्ट आर प्रेजेंट इन द अपर पार्ट फीमेल आर प्रेजेंट इन द लोअर पार्ट बॉटम okay that is known as monoecious okay then resin ducts occur in all parts this is very important okay if you understand this resins agar pade so you will be able to understand that conifera is one one part of the plant a uh, one family of the plant which have resin duct present in all parts okay this was very clear in the resin chapter okay so answer to this is conifera okay now taxels also are a part of conifera but since we are looking at the broader prospectum the correct answer will go as conifera okay so that that sit i think we are done with all the 25 questions okay any doubt you have or should i go through once more all the questions and then submit the test anyone has any doubt in any question okay so i'll submit a test okay so now one one i am getting as incorrect that is uh, one question uh, the answer marked in the in your that uh, question paper is incorrect okay that that i had by mistakenly marked ginger ral okay answer was general ginger all which i have marked right now but while i was giving the paper and answer that is that time the error has occurred so all the 25 correct answers are correct okay so we come to an end of this uh, test session